Hey there everybody, it's Sparkfire. In less than three hours, we are going to have the season premiere of The Walking Dead. And I'm pretty excited right now. They're finally going to show which major character has been killed off in the series. And if it comes down to two longtime fan favorites, Glenn and Daryl, and I know this will upset some people, I hope the combination of Negan and his trusty baseball bat Lucille go after Glenn. I can accept his death way easier than I could ever accept the death of Daryl, who is my favorite character th in the entire series. On the bright side, they did use the dad from Supernatural for the part of Negan, and the man's an incredible actor, so I'm excited to see how it all goes out. Until then, I'm going to play me some Black Ops 3, so let's see how much of a KD I can get. If you didn't see my last video, which is called sub for sub does it work the answer is no it does not work don't even try it I mean if you want to go ahead like it's none of my business but still it doesn't work for me so I'm not gonna ever attempt it now in that video I showed that I'm playing with bots I got three on my team and I maxed out the enemy bots and that puts us in a disadvantage because of where they're at veteran difficulty they seem to just kinda of run right through us but in the last game on sub for sub where I you just kinda of see it in the background I got a 47 and 20 something KD which isn't exactly a 3.0 ratio but it's kinda of somewhere in the middle and it was really incredible I have never done so well against veteran bots so I feel like I'm getting some skills at this game again which is great because I have played mostly advanced warfare so I guess I had a little bit of practice not too much I feel like I'm rambling so let's just get into this game and see how many kills I can actually get um I don't know what's gonna be in that smoke but if it triggers my bomb I'll be happy let's try that one too Come on. I feel like my back is covered right now. Or not. I just lost two teammates. There's three coming through. I just saw them pop up on the radar for a second. Two. Three. There we go. There shouldn't be anybody else over there. Or maybe there is somebody else over there. And my teammate died because of it. And I just died. Okay. So, we're really bad right now. Me and these bots on my team. I feel like setting it to veteran difficulty is not helping me I killed myself I'm great at this but <laughs> I feel like it affects the enemy bots but it doesn't affect my team when you said it's a veteran difficulty I feel like my team of bots is just really really bad is this a shotgun this is a shotgun okay I haven't used a lot of shotguns in this game so this should be fun let's see if I can actually get a kill with it Oh, oh, didn't see you come through. And I got two kills with a shotgun. That's not too bad. I could have got more if I raised my sensitivity, maybe. But I don't want my sensitivity too high. I feel like I'm not that fast. Let's keep my team covered a little bit. And there I go. Why did I shoot straight ahead? He was behind me. Did he just teleport? Where did he even go? Oh, flamethrower taken down. I am the fireman. Oh, good lord. Okay, that was a pretty epic kill. He got shot into the wall like I killed him with a nail gun or something. It was pretty epic. That looked really incredible. I liked it. Let's see what else we can do. I haven't played with this class too much, but I really like it. So I might start using her if I play online which this is kind of training for me to play online I'm going to probably use this class just because I'm getting used to it and I want to stick to a class that I know pretty well I usually play with the like pyro dude though and right now I'm just really not into him I'm not feeling that character so I want to learn how to use this one. Did he only shoot me one time? I feel like that's ridiculous. Come on, man. Shoot me more than that. Or just have everybody... Okay, never mind. <laughs> everybody just came running through there. Bots are a little predictable. That's kind of what like why I like playing with the bots. is because they're a little predictable. And no matter how hard the difficulty is, 
I can basically predict what they're going to do just because I'm used to playing with bots and everything. But when it comes to players online, you don't know what they're going to do. I've played Advanced Warfare online with some guys once and you could barely hit them because they just kept bouncing in the air to the point where it just got really irritating. But next round or next video because I'm not going to record it right now. I am going to play against players online and see how I do on there. If I do bad, then I'm coming right back to the bots set at veteran level and trying some more practice rounds. But that is going to be the entire video for now. So thank you all for watching. I have to go and get snacks ready for The Walking Dead. In the words of the Three Days Grace, if they kill Daryl, let's start a riot. You all stay awesome, and until next time, bye bye. Thank you.